Hey YouTube, my name is Tanya and you're watching Dropping Jewels and today I want to drop a jewel with you guys about the true identity of the black man and the white man <clears throat> and how we lost dominion on earth. Now my reference is actually coming from the New King James Version, Genesis chapter 1 and 2. In Genesis 1 and 26, God creates man in his image and likeness. He creates him, male, and female. Now, the likeness of God is the intelligence and the spirit of God, which is in man. And the image of God is the physical appearance of the five forces, elements of water, earth, air, sun, and gold. Now, all of these combined elements are the physical appearance of God. <clears throat> God also commands man to actually procreate. That's why he created male and female to procreate. He also blessed them by giving them dominion over all of the earth and everything in it. Now this is important because we learned this all in chapter one of Genesis and it's important also because it shows the separation of who we are and who Adam is now it helps supports the claim that we are um, the children of God because our genetics is the oldest gene known to earth and as well as you see the presence of the dominion of the black man all over earth. Now in chapter 2, Adam was created. Adam was actually formed. However, Adam was not formed in the likeness and image of God. Adam um, did not have, although Adam was formed in the physical with some of the elements, he did not have actually all five of elements. And Adam also did not have the spirit of God. He was a soulless man. He did not have the spirit or the intelligence of God. And this identifies with the white man because the white man is a soulless man without the intelligence of God. He's not able to communicate with God because God does not dwell in him. Now, Adam actually was given a task. He was commanded to till the garden. Adam did not have the commandment to procreate because it was only one of him. He um, never had a female counterpart to create, so God did not command him to do this. However, God did see that Adam was lonely, and he did give him Eve. However, they would never gave the commandment to procreate. Now, in the garden, Adam, excuse me, Eve was seduced by a serpent. We know this is a metaphor of a man because we know that a serpent cannot procreate with man. That's not possible. So the, the man that entered into the garden um, actually seduces Eve which causes them to go against the commandments of God in which God actually commanded them not to do certain things now this was found out about um, them going against God when Adam and Eve hid from God and when God asked them why are they hiding they said that they were naked this explains um, to us that Adam was not cognitive because he did not know that he was naked and the only way he knew he was naked he tells God that Eve tells him he was naked and Eve explains that the man or the serpent actually tells her that she was naked now Adam actually um, loses his separation from God when he's kicked out of the garden so when he's separated from God 
he struggles. He struggles outside of the garden because he does not have the intelligence. He was not given the spirit of God. He has to be taught everything. We know this to be true because everything that the white man has knows he has learned from us. He has learned from the intelligence of the black man in which God created. Now we being um, black men, we actually lost dominion because we seduced Eve and had her to go against God. So God cursed us and we fell. The metaphor is that the serpent fell and was crawling on his belly. But we know that that translates to the fall of man, which is us, when we lost dominion on earth. Now, all of this is in Genesis chapter 1 and 2. I am going to have a follow-up video explaining more about what happened in the garden. But I just want us to meditate on this and get an idea of who Adam actually is and who we are and to help us to move forward with more answers that are going to be given to us. So if this was helpful, please like and subscribe because I do have more videos coming and a follow-up video uh, regarding this.